gosh um it's the next day far cry from what i looked like the other day actually um yeah but i'm in my house and we're not shooting today and i'm very tired because what i've noticed is that i can only really do a full day of work or an activity and then the next day i literally just need to sit down and do nothing so that's me more or less today see with pregnancy what i've realized obviously you know you get darker so my dark pigmentation is starting to come in now it will all go away once i've had the baby but yeah i noticed the other day my face has got darker and my neck has got darker and my boobs have got darker as well but that's tmi um and i did say that we were going somewhere today but i couldn't remember i knew i had something to do today it's date night this evening so we're going into london um for a nice little dinner me and my husband spend some time together and then i'm gonna try and convince him to go into harrods with me because i just want to see if i can pick up some perfume um i really want to pick up uh some mfk um grand soir not many women buy that scent but i am in love with that scent it's unisex more geared to men but i feel like anyway it's my i, I just love it so i'm gonna get it and then i'm gonna get um killian don't be shy as well so those are the two perfumes i might pick up today hopefully and then i might go into hermes if i don't feel too intimidated I might go into Hermes and I'm not in no position to buy no bag right now let me just put that out there but I do want to create a wish list and um just like start building a relationship with an essay and hopefully eventually get a Kelly so that's my plans today but I wanted to show you so I I was on eBay a few days ago um baby's fine by the way i'm just giving him a little rub because he's kicking um i wanted to what was i saying oh gosh yes ebay so i still shop on ebay like i said i bought a balenciaga um blazer the other day for like a fraction of the retail price and um i've been after some amina muadis i've got one pair already that my husband bought me for my birthday a few years ago but there was an, i wanted like the classic sling backs with the crystal on the front i wasn't fussed about what material or what color so i've been on the hunt for them um one of my friends owns a personal shopping business and she's always selling them for cheaper than online a, a little bit cheaper than online um but she hadn't had posted any for a while so i went on a hunt oh, oh her name is her business name is classless classless i'll link her below on instagram fantastic she sources like some of the best bits um for such a good price i literally recently ordered a bottega um jody mini from her and i have been waiting for her to get some of those and she finally got one in the color that i wanted and i snapped it up straight away because um yeah online that color is more or less sold out and i got it for like 200 pounds cheaper than the retail price so i'm really really happy about that so like i said was waiting for her to grab some aminas but i hadn't found any anyway went on ebay and thought let me try my luck so i saw a seller was selling them and they were at 380 at the time i was like okay and i checked them up properly and i checked out i i know how to shop on ebay so obviously you check their feedback you check how many items they've sold you check um what current items they have selling at that time and she had loads of different designers and perfumes and candles and they're all high-end stuff so i knew that i was i was buying from a trusted um seller then i realized it was even a charity even better so i knew they were legit i could tell from the box i could tell from 
because like I said I've got a pair already so I could tell from the box I could tell from the packaging I could tell that it was a authentic pair of Amina Moadis um this is the charity and it says how your purchase has helped a disabled child in the planet so I'm really happy that my money's gone to good use in that sense and wait for how much I, I got them for now these shoes they retail for I think eight nine five and some resellers are selling it for like nine in the nine hundreds just because they're so hard to come to buy now that like they're always sold out. Um I didn't mind the PVC ones but then I'm glad I didn't get those because I did see a PVC pair online as well for seven hundred and I thought okay if I don't win these ones then I'll just bite the bullet and buy the PVC ones. But then I was on I watched Nori's um, vlog. Oh, sorry, that's so disgusting. But then I watched Nori's vlog the other day and she tried them on and the sling back was just falling off the back of her foot and I thought, that's not very good. But I'm, I'm guessing that's because of how many people probably tried on that display pair, which then begs the question okay if that's the case how many weights can you get out of it before it starts flopping down and because it's pvc it's just one piece of material going all the way around you can't really get that adjusted i don't think i'm not sure anyway i'm just glad i didn't get that pair and i won the satin pair and i paid four five five four hundred five fifty five pounds for a new pair of amina muwadis that are still current still in season and brand new so i'm gonna open it up and show you guys the box is a little bit battered but i'm not really fussed about that because i don't keep boxes anyway so yep this is exactly like my other pair it's beautiful pink satin silk dust bag which is just so yummy same um paper and I got a colour that I wouldn't normally get but like I said all of their shoes are so beautiful to me it doesn't matter what colour you get as long as you get a pair so yeah I'm really excited to try these on they're so 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 gorgeous so beautiful okay so I have them on now they're actually a five and a half and I feel like I should that's the one thing about um, buying things online on eBay because they were actually listed as a 39 and it wasn't until I had put my bid in that I realised it was a 38 and a half but I thought I'd try anyway and they are a little bit snug but nothing I can't deal with if that makes sense but how gorgeous are they let me take off this part Whew. guys I'm out of breath again just for trying on shoes you know out of breath oh god oh gosh wow they are bloody stunning Ooh, i feel like a little cinderella i mean look at that and i've been wanting a pair of these forever so yeah super 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 happy with these i might just sit here all day in them so my husband's finally got rid of his range he hated this car hated it hated it so much that he didn't even drive it so he drove my car more than he drove his own and it's gone let's see what he gets next hey guys so i've just come to my son's nursery to pick him up um, and we're gonna drop him off to grandma's and go out for our date night Whew, I'm wearing a polar neck because it's cold in England even in spring I'm matching he loves the camera don't be fooled this one you always want to be in it come say hi <laughs> this traffic going into London I think we've got so used to Essex life like because we barely we don't come down here anymore like that 
especially not on a Friday evening and we missed our booking at Harry's because of someone me? you trying to blame me? <laughs> my fault uh, it's both our faults because see what it is the I was, car I was, no, I, the, I was no, 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 no. things that had to be done no the you car you home on your ass no I wasn't I was sleeping uh, oh uh, so, so I take the lie down your ass yeah but uh, uh, lie down excuse me I am in my ass. third trimester oh, eight months hello yes right well shush so mean so I'm not allowed to rest again because of what please yeah I'm not allowed but to be honest the Range Rover got picked up but, but the guy came really late as well so we had to wait for him and I didn't um I was meant to let my mother-in-law know what time we was getting to her house to drop off our son and we didn't do that so when we got there we 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 that's a that's a big we after that moment that conversation I did not even know you had to call anyway, my, my mom. We missed let her know. the no, no, it's not we. We missed the I, reservation, unfortunately. I, Alexis. Alexis. Me. Okay? Yeah? Because even still. To be honest, as I said, into I, I, London no, no, no. is so. Excuse me. There's just too much traffic. Talking, okay? I, I said to you yesterday, you should call your the, 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 the child care and let them know to pick up Ozzy yesterday. You did not do that. Pick up yesterday. Anyway, anyway, you're going off topic. Now. I'm not going off topic. The point is if that we missed it. Aussie, and we had to talk about Aussie. Mum said that she can't pick him up. Yes, but if we, but if we. And my mum said she was tired. So oh, oh, oh. really and truly, it was never going to happen. We had to still pick him up. Either way, it was all tight. It was a very tight rush day. So now we found an alternative. Italian spot, which I don't even know if it's going to be nice, but it's in Docklands, and yeah, the traffic is just mad. But we are dressed appropriately because Ian outside is not a joke. Like I said, it's actually cold, even though it's the first of May tomorrow. Hmm. When we were in Queens, huh? Huh? Handsome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So handsome. Who's queuing up where? New Wolf. Maybe. How much of the food, sir? It was the gnocchi with the forex prawns, garlic bread, and spaghetti carbonara, right? Yes. And, and it was calamari. And a calamari. Thank you. Oh so, yeah, we made it to a really cute um, Italian restaurant in Docklands and apparently it's the best food the best Italian someone said to us so I hope not to be disappointed oh yeah guys I did tell you my new bag came today <laughs> I'm not allowed to buy anything else for the rest of this year <laughs> Anyway, yeah, we cut you off, bro. When you start saying you need peace, bro, we had to give it, bro. Excuse me. I've got my own money. Thank you very go, much. We're gonna pull that bag, bro. Take it to the anyway. Brokers. I'll see you at cash money, bro. <laughs> anyway, I'm not gonna buy anything until my birthday, which is in July. And then, yeah, I think I'm done now. I've got everything out of my system. I've got a hat coming. That's the last thing I'm waiting for. Yes, I bought a hat or a baseball cap because sometimes I just want to hide. Oh yeah, and sunglasses. I need sunglasses. I need some dark sunglasses and perfume. Oh, see, uh, you go from <laughs> I'm finished to I'm, I need this, I need that. Do you know what? Yeah, these these are things I'm just ticking off my list. Yeah, but anyway. List, list I don't want I just don't understand why all husbands are like this with their wives. Just let us be. Ugh. Anyway, it is cold, but not as cold as I expected it to be because we've got a nice heater behind us, thankfully. And I, we've got something to cover us, so just in case it starts drizzling or something. It's like I need to eat now. I'm so hungry. I love 
love this car. Love, love, love this car. Oh, gosh. Hi, guys. So, I'm currently at the Porsche showroom getting my car serviced and they have given us a courtesy car an orange cayman where's my son gonna sit on the roof why oh wow okay <laughs> that means for the next like gosh two days we're not gonna go out together gonna be me or my son in the passenger seat imagine putting a whole car seat in here it's just so strange like I've never seen a child in a um, in a sports car before I wasn't gonna vlog this but I thought no this is actually too interesting not to vlog so here we are we've got all this stuff I told my husband to clear the car before we come he's like oh we'll just put it in the boot we'll just put it in the boot Look at us now. Can't even see out the rear, um, the rear window. And interestingly enough, it has another boot at the front. So, thank God for that. But even still, oh, Friday needs to hurry up and come because I'm already not enjoying this, um, <laughs> this little car. It's so tiny. <laughs> oh my days. He finds it very funny. This is hilarious, bro. It's not funny. <laughs> I feel like I don't even want. I feel like the car's been squashed at the back, this just is... pushed in. <laughs> it just doesn't even make sense. <laughs> I would never get a two seater. This is no Actually, sense. no, that's the lie. I would get a two seater no, but car, but it just wouldn't be. This car is yeah, tiny. So if you got the nine eleven, then the back is a little bit bigger. <clears throat> yeah. Lord, grant us journey mercies in Jesus' name. We pray, Amen. That just makes it long, bruv. Yeah, I know. But thank God it's just two days. This is yeah. one week and all that jazz. We said no. We we'll say no. Like we need another car. But um, it's just two days. So by Friday, Miss Porsche will be back. This is quite cool, though. The cup holders. Well, to be honest, there ain't much space in this car anyway. But I think that's quite cool cup holder comes out there for both driver and passenger I'm guessing um yeah how's it feeling babe I mean it's nice to be in a, in a manual car again but I'm really this is bare work <laughs> in London a manual car is just all in just in general it's just work we're gonna get back at 12. Wow, okay. Long journey ahead. It's a nice pink house. Oh, so I'm back home. I've had such a busy, busy, busy morning. We dropped our son off to grandma's, then went to get my car serviced, and then they gave us the Cayman that you saw. It's like a mini sports, like a, smart car but phew, I don't even know how to explain it it's just I feel like it's like the sporty version of a smart car it's so tiny inside um now it's then I, after that I went to see my friend in Rochester quickly um because it was her birthday a few weeks ago oh, excuse me and I've been meaning to go and see her so I went to see her to drop off her present and we had a nice catch up. But it was really short lived because I had to leave again to come back home. Because we had date night tonight. Oh, my wig is like moving back but I just really can't remember to fix it. It's date night in like an hour. Our reservation is an hour away and do I look date ready? No. But I don't think I'm going to dress up. Or put on any makeup or anything. I'm just too pregnant for all that stuff right now. So I'm gonna get some glasses. Put them on. I might put on a bit of concealer. Um, we're having dinner at Rocker. 
want a bit of concealer and wear like my Jacquemus glasses and trainers because I don't think it's formal dressing they can't expect people to be doing formal dressing in this weather and that's one thing about going out to dinner in the evening during this little lockdown not lockdown whatever they want to call it so it's too cold to dress up dress up so I'm just wearing a tracksuit and we'll <sighs> lord I'm tired David said I look like I don't want to go and it's not that I don't want to go I do want to go I'm just tired it's been a very very busy day so yeah have you finished all your meetings now babe yeah, yeah, yeah. so you should go because it's like four o'clock what's the route last time I checked it was saying we should leave by four fifteen. Four fifteen. 15 okay let me quickly go and do my I would say 4.30 yeah but that's that's if we leave now obviously it's not factoring that trap is going to build up so should we leave at 4.15 you get ready to just leave now okay I'm just going to put on a bit of concealer and wear some glasses what time is it 5.30 5 not 5.30 is it 5 yeah yeah let's just go oh you did it for 5.30 no yeah I was looking at 5.30 oh my camera is here now so better quality <laughs> videos henceforth <sighs> so I'm just gonna put on look my hair's all ratty I just look like a hot mess nothing sexy about this <sighs> okay we'll brush this in the car put on my top so I'm just gonna do a quick like conceal just brighten up my eyes a little bit I normally use Fenty cream concealer I love this concealer I don't think I'm gonna use that because I feel like it's so heavy and creamy I'm gonna use my Maybelline eraser instead just to there's a bit more it's not as bright basically something there I'm just gonna blend that in a little bit I hope I don't look weird see yeah my eyes look a little bit I look a little bit more awake Right guys, I'm gonna go finish off. I think the next time I see you, I'll be at the restaurant. hungry so, uh, it was proper 
getting down outside. Anyway. It's chuckins. So it's kind of indoor, outdoorsy. That's what makes it outdoor. So that's like a balcony. But it's not so bad. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Really? Oh, that's disappointing. Like, we had at that place. In Ghana. Yeah, their food was nice though. They're just, the service is terrible. I just tried to take some pictures. And I just look like a big fat hippo. So we're not even going to bother to post those. You're supposed to disagree. This is your point of reference where you say, Oh no, honey! No, no. <laughs> the food was so nice at Roca. I actually went there a few years ago and it wasn't nice, but this time it was delicious. In a way, delicious. Delicious. It was his first time there. So, he ate to new experiences. <laughs> So what are we doing now? We're going to go home. Watch, 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 watch movies. Let's finish our red. I want to get home at 4 in the morning. Okay. Someone's living in fantasy land. Let's go and watch that um, new Michael B. Jordan film. Eh? Oh, Prime. Yeah. Prime. On Prime. Prime. Ciao. Say bye. <laughs> Bye.